Uh oh. It's been a long time since I visited my island. I hope they're not mad at me. It's been three months, hasn't it, my lord alike? Three months? No, you're lying. Everything's okay. Everything's okay. Okay, good. <laughs> Yeah, guys, welcome back to Diamond Island, or more specifically, Tomodachi Life, where I haven't visited in a while. I'm so, so sorry. We're back. Let's ignore that for a second and go ahead and check the donations fountain. Here we go. Look at this. Lots of people in. The minion needs an outfit, definitely. Everyone else's outfits, though, are looking positively awesome. I am liking them. Right, let's skip this. How much money did we get? 215, that's actually pretty decent. We're up to 1,500 or just over 1,500 pounds in the pot. So where should we go next? Uh, I feel like we should go and hit up some mean news just to see what's been going on since we've been away. And Ross is going to do the news. Welcome to the afternoon edition of Me News. What have you got? What do you got for me? Oh. This unbelievable discovery was made today. Okay. A smoothie was discovered with a best before date that was five years overdue. Ugh. And Incredible was amazed to find the putrid product at the back of his fridge. <laughs> and Incredible said, I can't believe it. The date is exactly five years ago today. That's disgusting. We asked some islanders their opinions. It's not really my kind of thing. Not really. You learn something new every day. <laughs> Thanks for watching. No problem. That was um that was pretty interesting. Mr. Incredible, you left a glass, not a packet, not not like a bottle of smoothie, literally a glass of smoothie in the back of your fridge for five years. Five years, that is insane. Right, the afternoon market is on. Oh, those look amazing. I'm using the myself. You you made them yourself? Sans, that's incredible. They're a hundred pounds. I'm gonna buy one of those bad boys. And I'm oh, wait, you got a sewing machine as a freebie? Nice, thanks, buddy. Is that what you use to make this? That's cool. I like that, Sans. Thank you so much. That's really nice of you. <laughs> so before we go and check out our Mies, let's head to all of our different stops on the island. The first one being Happy New Year. Oh, buddy, thanks. Happy New Year to you as well. Right, we got some fried eggs. Let's buy some of those. Let's buy, you know, let's buy four of those because I think we're going to dish out a lot of fried eggs. Mince pies, they might be a little bit off by now. We've got polenta as well, like an Italian porridge. It is boiled or fried and eaten with meat or veg. That's actually pretty cool. I'm going to buy a couple of those. There we go. We're going to need to top up on some food. Let's buy some mince pies anyway, and then we're going to need some meals. Let's grab some bacalao because I know a lot of people like those. Barbecued meat. Let's buy a couple of those. Beef bone and yang. Let's buy a couple of those. I'm just buying like two of everything. I'm not sure if that's a good thing to do because uh, this is this is expensive food up in here. This is very, very expensive food. But let's buy some fried seafood. There's one that I definitely want to buy, which is gratin. I seem to give that to absolutely everyone and they enjoy it. So that'll do for food. I think we're pretty stocked up. We do have a lot of islanders now though, like a ton of islanders. I need to go and check them out. But first, it's hat store time. Please be a good hat. Oh, we've got an apple hair clip. That's okay, that's not too bad. A silk bandana, I like that. Not sure about the color. And turban. Oh man, I was hoping for this color of a turban so I could put that on Voldemort. You guys know, if you like Harry Potter, you will know why I would do that. We could put that on him. You know what, let's put that on him for now. That'll do for now. Until we get a purple one, a purple turban, that'll do. Oh my goodness, look, a bubble hat. Oh, that's so cool. Right, we need to buy some of these things. We've got hats with ear flaps. Plain woolly hat, Russian hat, slouch hat, striped faux fur hat. Right, we need to buy a hat with ear flaps. We need to buy a blue one of those. Let's buy a blue one of those. There we go. We also need to grab a bobble hat in pink and also in black as well. There we go. Because it, even though it's not Christmas anymore, it's still pretty cold. And there's also a faux fur headband as well. That's looking a little bit strange. Let's grab a pink one anyway. I mean, why not? Let's grab one of those. And let's go and see if there's any special um, winter-themed interiors. Actually, we need to go to clothes first. Let's go to clothes. I'm still hoping Gust works here. Everyone's being so, so nice to me. Right, we've got a ballet top. Is that a ballet top? Is that what a ballet top looks like? I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain about it. We've got dinner jackets as well. 
They're 200 pounds. So we actually bought a really cheap one. We bought a half price one from Sans because he made them himself. We've got some overalls, tunic and leggings, and turtleneck and skirt. Right. I think I'm going to buy some overalls. Those look pretty cool. I like them a lot. Very nice indeed. Let's buy some of those. And they're only 19 pounds. And let's see if there's anything else. We've got some seasonal wear, collared sweater, military coat, pea jacket, and a puffer jacket. I actually really like this pea jacket. Let's go for... Let's go for yellow. It's 73 pounds, but that's fine. Got lots of new stuff in today, like tons. Oh, this is cute as well. This is really cute. Uh, let's go for, let's go bright pink. Let's do that. It's 50 pounds. Oh my gosh, we got so much stuff. Look at all this new stuff. It's amazing. Ugly Christmas jumper. You know what? That's 122 pounds. That should be half off because it's not Christmas no more. And a woolly jumper as well. You know what? Let's buy one of these. Woolly jumper is a really, really expensive snowboarding outfit. Nice, it's 48 pounds. What have we got in actual outfits? A Santa costume. Oh, I'm gonna have to buy this. I'm gonna have to buy this, but I'm not sure who to give it to. Let's go for a yellow one, because then you can wear it out of season as well. We spent so much money. So much money. <laughs> I know it's not Christmas anymore, but a yellow Santa outfit still has to happen. Um, and we need to go to the interior shop as well. Hey, Homer, how you doing, buddy? You look good in that outfit. I like it, right? There is a winter one. Oh, look at that. We've got an office one as well. Space station is 2000 and sweets. I'm going to spend all my money today. Literally all my money. Uh, I have to buy the winter one. That's way too cute. Um, is there special ones in stock? No, there's just today's items. Got an office and we got sweets. I'm going to buy sweets as well. Right. Let's start dishing out some of this new stuff. We bought a lot today. We've gone from 1,500 to 200 pounds. And I definitely, definitely need to keep checking my stuff every single day. Otherwise, we're going to be in trouble. All right. We've got some problems to sort out. Who's got problems? Everyone's out today. Look, everyone's having a great time. Right. Oh, no, skeleton. What's up, buddy? Are you okay? I must be really tired. Yeah, you must be. Do you feel sick? Are you okay? What's wrong? I got a cold. Oh, no, he's got a cold, right? To be honest, we have an absolute ton of cold medicine. Check it out. You'll be right as rain in no time. And I've got lots of food to give you as well. The medicine worked. That's what I like to hear, buddy. That's what I like to I hear, think right? My fever's gone down. Oh, good. Okay, you know what will drown out a cold? Oh, you leveled up as well. All right, level five. Let's do this. I'm gonna give you a football. Have a football. It kind of matches your top quite nicely. <laughs> Have this as a reward. And a reward as well. I like it, Skelebone. Disposable camera. I do like the disposable cameras. What you got to say? I don't like talking behind people's backs. Well, you shouldn't do. That's very, very rude. And I am going to give you some chicken tikka masala to just make sure that cold is perfectly drowned out. Clear your sinuses. Breathe in the magic that is tikka masala. And he liked it a lot. I like it. It's only second in his likes, actually. And we're slowly Seeing gaining. Oh, let's play. Let's play a game. Okay, let's play. What are we going to play? Oh, no, it's catch. It's catch. And what is that? Is that coral? Here okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Two. Don't trick me. One. Don't trick me. Don't trick me. Here we go. Ah. Really hey. What's wrong with you? Here we go. No, I missed it. Oh, give me another chance. Yes, give me another chance. Here we go. One more time, please. That was terrible. I really want this coral for some reason. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. Come on. Come on. Don't trick me. Sometimes I get worried about dropping things from so high up. It's fine. It's fine. Just drop it. Yes. That was so close. So close. Oh my goodness, right, I got the coral. I don't know what it does, but I got the coral. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. I got the coral. This is for you. Dante DMs look alike. Thank you so much, buddy. Thank you so much. There we go. A piece of coral. It's been put in with my treasures. Fantastic. Right, see you later, buddy. Thanks for that. That was cool. Look, every like half the people are out today. Right, who's got a problem now? Taylor, are you okay? Taylor. Taylor, you're on the floor. You're hurting. Right, I'm actually going to change her hair, actually, because I think she deserves. A nice wintry cap, because she's been wearing that one for a long time. You, Dante DMs look alike, aren't you? Yes. That, that, that's, that's me. What's your problem? Can you give me something to say when I'm happy? I certainly can. What would you, what should we get her to say? Um, oh, I've got it. I've got it. Here we go. You ready for this, guys? Are you ready? I'm feeling 22. <laughs> I don't know about you, 
But I'm feeling 22. That's what that's what she's gonna say. I shouldn't have sung that. Wow. And to go with that, you're gonna get a ballet manual as well. Enjoy it. Practice your dance moves. I want to see you say that more often than not. Right. What should we give you? Oh, actually, let's see what you're gonna say first. I try to smile even when times are tough. That's good advice. That's good advice. These me's come out with some good advice. Right. Let's go for bacalao, shall we? That's not on your like. So let's see if you do like it or not. Do you like it? Do you like it? You kind of like it. You like it a little. That's not too bad. Do you like it more than anything else? You don't. Right. Let's get out of here. Thank you, Taylor. What's in your What's in your brain box today? Oh, <laughs> you're just making funny faces. That's fine. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, is she doing ballet? I think she's doing ballet. Taylor's doing ballet. She's feeling 22. There we go. Look at that. That's cool. Oh, actually, I forgot to give her a new hat. Now, do we want to give her the bubble hat or why did I Why did I buy that? That's horrific. Oh my goodness. Right, we've got a cooking cap, hat ear with flaps, hat with ears, or top hat. We're gonna go for the bobble hat, I think. The pink bobble hat will suit her very nicely. Hopefully she switches out the hair, because I think that counts as a hat. Hopefully, let's see. You might look a lot better. There we go. That's so much better. Look at that. It even matches your pink. She loves it as well. Oh, that's perfect. Didn't quite level up, but she is feeling awesome. Oh. <laughs> Why are you thinking about Harambe? Why? That's a 2016 meme. Come on, Taylor. Get with the 2017 times. We need new memes. New memes. Toriel is looking insanely happy right now, and I think she deserves a hat or two. Definitely. Would you like to see a weird face that I've been practicing? I certainly would. I think that would be awesome. Right, you ready? Here we go. Hey, look at that. How did- how did you move your eyes like that? That's creepy. Uh, it's, um, it's funny. It's funny. I'm happy you liked it. <laughs> These guys are so, so weird. And I get a reward just for looking at her silly face. I like that a lot. Here we go. Stomach medicine. We've got absolutely tons of stomach medicine. We can start selling that. Everyone gets along well in your world. Right. Yeah, they do actually. They do. Right. What do you want to eat? I'm going to go for barbecued meat. Uh, I don't know actually. Yeah, barbecued meat. I think you're going to like that. Let's see. You like apple pie and grilled mackerel. Nice. You liked it a lot. Surely it can't beat pie. It can beat pie. Tori, are you feeling okay? Oh, jeez. Okay, right. You've got a nice background, but let's see what kind of hats we've got to give you. Bobble hats. We don't have any pink ones anymore. We've got a black one. A brimmed bobble hat. Cooking cap. Oh, I don't know if any of these are going to suit her, to be honest. We could go for a top hat. I'm not sure. Let's come back to that because I'm not 100% sure right now. All right, Jigglypuff's got an issue. Jigglypuff, weren't you wearing a hat? You look so funny from the back, by the way. You look like a bold man. I like it. Right, let's enter here. We can give Jigglypuff a hat, and I think I know which one I'm going to give you. <laughs> I can't believe you didn't visit for a whole month. Okay, Jigglypuff, geez, calm down, please. Can you calm down? Thank you. I'd like some new clothes. Something simple would be sweet. Something simple. Something simple, huh? Something real simple like a... Oh, what can I give you? What can I give you? Winter dress, that'll look kind of funny. Woolly jumper, overalls. I'm kind of feeling the Santa costume, actually. Or the Uncle Sam. Santa or Uncle Sam? Santa? I think Santa. Oh, or Uncle Sam. I'm going Santa. Right, let's go Santa. Let's do this. Here we go. A big old yellow Santa outfit. This is simple, right? Simple and yellow. Here we go. Yes. Oh, she loves it as well. Yes. Oh, we did so well. That's perfect. <laughs> We're actually gaining a decent amount of money as well. That's perfect. And she's giving me a reward. Definitely made the right choice. Hair color spray. Oh, nice. What would happen if we would use it on Jigglypuff, though? That'd be weird. I wonder what lies beyond the horizon. You will never know. You will never, never know. Right, let's go for... Do you like cheeseburgers, Jigglypuff? I think you look like a person who likes cheeseburgers. Definitely. Oh. She didn't like it much at all. Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. And there it is. Cheeseburger in the belly. <laughs> Whoa! Loads of people want to play games right now. Now, in the previous video, two people almost got married. And I can't actually remember who it was. I think it was Smiley. You've gone to the amusement park. You know what? Let's go and see if she's there with Phil. She's gone to the amusement park, which is here. Let's see what's going down. She's... Oh, wait. She's here with Finn. And she's here with Jem, and she's here with Elsa as well. That's amazing. Look at that. 
That's hilarious. <laughs> Day out at the fairground for everyone. I missed the magic show again. Always missing the magic show. It's because it's on so early. Calling Smiley. How are you doing, Smiley? You're doing good. I feel like you and Phil should be called back because I think you're going to have something nice on the brain for me. We finally meet again. Wow. Everyone's really, really laying into me today. Phil has gone to the park. Let's locate him right now. What are you doing at the park, buddy? Oh my goodness. What is going on here? It's snowy and you're wearing literally no clothes. Oh my word. I'm going to take a picture of this just because it's so random. It's even more random now he's looking at the camera. <laughs> Where are you going, Phil? Where are you going? What are you doing? Are you doing anything in particular or are you just, you just kind of chilling out? That's fine. I'm leaving. Right, Homer's got a problem. It looks like he's got a bit of a broken back. Look at that hunch. You shouldn't hunch like that, Homer, because it's not good for your back. And you're not exactly the youngest person in the world. I can't believe you didn't visit for a whole month. People are very mad at me today. Very mad. I'm really hungry. Of course you are right. Don't worry. I got your favorites. I got you some cheeseburgers, buddy. Your number one favorite meal. Um, I'm gonna check on his relationship, actually, and see how he feels like things are going with Misty. Because I think I have a good feeling about them, too. A very good feeling. Oh, and I got a reward for the cheeseburger. Thanks, buddy. What's it gonna be? It's gonna be? It's another disposable camera. I like it. Voldemort singing was such a surprise. He was amazing. <laughs> He certainly was. He certainly was. Right. What was I going to do? Oh, yeah. Check the relationships. Oh, he wants to get married to Misty. Oh, that's awesome. Now, where is Misty's house? Misty. Misty, I've got some important news for you. Misty. Misty, where are you? I've lost you. There she is. She is holding her cat by the armpits. And she's also wearing a cat outfit kind of as well. She's a like half cat, half mermaid. It's a little bit conflicted. Put off until tomorrow what you can do the day after. What? That doesn't even make sense. Anyway, what's your relationship? Bam! Oh, very much in love. Um, you know what? Let's see if we can get them to go out together. Let's give them... Let's give them a disposable camera and see if they'll take selfies together or something. That would be absolutely awesome. Uh, what kind of photo? You want to take an Islander's photo. Got it. I'm going to get snapping. Please choose Homer. Please, here we go. Please choose Homer. She's taking photos. I think she did it. What is it? What is it? What is it? Please be Homer. That's not Homer, but that's a pretty impressive photo. Look at that. Action shot. It looks like they're playing Wii Sports, maybe. Let's save that bad boy. I like it. But that that's not Homer. You wanted to go on a trip with Homer so you like each other more. I call it childhood friend. That's nice. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm going to give it a big old... I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. That was good. Well, I guess it isn't perfect. It's not perfect. You know why? Because Homer wasn't in it. That's why. Right, because you're dressed up as a cat. We're going to give you uh, some fish cakes to eat. How are you feeling about those, huh? Okay. They could be better, but you know what? Look, their likes, their number one likes are even the same. They both love cheeseburgers. How can I get them to go out together? I guess I could give them a travel ticket, but I'm not sure if I want to do that right now. How many travel tickets do we have? We have just the one. I don't think anything else here will let them be, um, let them be together. So, you know what? I'm just going to leave it for now. Very much in love. Right. What other couples have we got? Marceline, you have a problem. You're not with anyone, but let's see if the problem is to do with that or not. We finally meet again. Dante DMs look alike. We finally meet again. How are you doing, Marceline? How's it going? I want to take a bath. Okay, uh, that's, that's fine. You know what? We have lots of bath sets. We have six, in fact. So go ahead, take your bath. Uh, make sure you don't take that hat in, though, because the color might come out and it'll just be awful. It's always kind of awkward, actually, so I'm going to get out of here. <laughs> actually, I'm going to give Marceline a new... Oh, my goodness, look at that. That looks amazing. Do they always wear the towel on their head? If not, they should do, because that's awesome. <laughs> I don't make holiday plans. I just do whatever I feel like. You know what? That's absolutely fine. Right, let's see if we can give you an apartment. We've got pumpkin patch, sweets, or winter. You know what? I think you're going to suit... Oh, I kind of think she'll suit winter, actually. Winter or sweets? Who else? No, Princess Bubblegum needs sweets, so I'm going to go winter for Marceline. It's going to be a bit cold, though. Very cold. Yeah, she definitely suits that, especially with the night sky. I really like it. No problem. I'm glad you like it. Should we take a look around? I think we should. Here we go. Let's have a look. We've got uh, penguins. Is that a snow bunny? That's cute. I like that. Look at that door. 
That's incredible. We've got skis, a snowboard, a big fat igloo, two igloos, a big old penguin, and a sled. I like that. You might need to change your outfit, though. Maybe. And you've leveled up. Right, what can we give you that is to do with your brand new apartment? We should probably give you a hat. But for now, we're going to give you... We're going to give you a mirror because we give all of our little me's mirrors because they can change their outfits randomly if you have some available. But for now, you look good in your wintry, wintry house with your, with your bathrobe on. I mean, what's going on, right? You need to eat something that will keep you nice and warm. Rizzole! Oh, I didn't buy any Rizzole. Loads of people love that. Look, I've been, I've been feeding cheeseburgers to everyone. Oh, she didn't like that. She actually didn't like it. Okay, that's annoying. But anyway, she's, she's partially, well, she's mostly full. Let's get out of here. We need to give out some more stuff. She's actually staring into a mirror right now, pondering life. Wondering what's going on. <laughs> Looks like Freddy has a problem as well. He's kind of dangling his cat. Oh, he dropped her. Okay, let's, let's, let's ignore that. Let's not call any kind of animal authorities on him. It was a mistake. It's okay. I'm starving. You're starving? Oh, dear. What does Freddy want to eat? I think he can go for a nice English breakfast. Take that, buddy. Chomp it down. And apparently don't like it. Why didn't you like that? Such a good meal. I don't take holiday photos. My eyes are my lens and my heart is the film. That is so, so cute. Right, well, how are your relationships doing? Uh, mostly fun, not a great match with those two. Okay, that's not too bad. It looks like PB's on the top of his list in terms of female attention because, unfortunately, in this game, uh, like, males and males and females and females can't get together, which is a little bit questionable, but... Um, hey, it would be cool if you could get some same gender relationships in this game, but unfortunately you cannot. Oh, those just popped up. I like that Spider-Man. Oh my goodness, Spider-Man is looking really cool right now. <laughs> it's been three weeks, hasn't it? Dante DMs look alike. Uh, no. Someone claimed it was three months. Some people are claiming it's three weeks. Um, oh, he's questioning Phil's authority. Oh my goodness. I'd like to introduce Elsa to somebody. You would? How about two-faced? Okay, yeah, let's do that. That sounds great, because that's just going to be a friend relationship. What should you talk about? You should talk about hobbies. I mean, why not? Let's see. Call them both over, see if this is going to be a match made in heaven. Look at that. That's some aggressive conversation going on. Real aggressive. This is a long conversation. A very, very long conversation. Did it work? Oh, did it work? They didn't hit it off well. Ooh. Is that affecting our 100%? I think Sans would look better if he changed his hairstyle. Spider-Man. Sp Sp Spider-Man. He doesn't have any hair, so he can't. He can't change his hairstyle. Right, uh, we've got a pumpkin patch and a sweet collection for you. I don't think any of those are going to suit you, but, but I tell you what will. We can give you a hat. I think, I think I'm going to give you the hat with ears, 100%. It's going to replace your horn, but your horn's getting a little bit boring. I, I can tell you don't like it. Oh my goodness. No, don't be angry. Don't be angry. That looks amazing on you, buddy. Oh man, I'm so upset you don't like it. So I am going to give you a big old fried egg. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Literally a fried egg on a plate. I love that. <laughs> That's so funny. How are you doing? Did you like that too? He liked it a little bit. Okay. We got a fussy one over here, guys. I feel like we need like a really cool cityscape or something for the background for um, Spider-Man. But hey, we'll find one in the future. There's a lot of problems going on here. We've got Harry's got a problem. Skeleton. Oh, that's so cute. Look at them too. That's so cute. Can I take a picture? I can. Oh, that's nice. Right. Let's see what his problem is. This is the second problem you've had in one day, Skelebone. Remember that. Hello. Hello, how's it going? Right, what's your problem? I'd like some new clothes. Oh. Something warm would be great. Okay, well, first off, I need to check your relationship status with Gemma. Only just in love. Okay, that's not too great, because I would have given you the suit. Like, the dinner jacket, because I think that'll look awesome on you. Got a pea jacket that we can give him. We've also got a shirt dress. That looks amazing. That would look amazing on him, too. Bath towel. Woolly jumper. You know what? Let's give him Wooly Jumper because he's got no skin, so he's going to be pretty cold most of the time. So we're going to give him the Wooly Jumper so he keeps nice and warm in this cold weather. Look at him! I even forgot he was bold. I forgot <laughs> I forgot this skeleton was bold, but that really does suit him. I like it a lot. Yeah, but it, it seems to be that he agrees as well. Stomach medicine. Oh, 
Why why do people keep giving me stomach medicine? I wanna be friends with Misty forever. That's really cute. That's really, really cute. Where is Misty's? You just says great fun though. Are you sure? <laughs> right, I'm gonna go and quickly check on myself because I think I need a new outfit. I like the gnome outfit, but I think I'm gonna change it. I love to. <laughs> you love to, you certainly do, buddy. How's it going? I'd never feel uncomfortable introducing Taylor to anyone. That's cool. I like that. Right. Completely in love with Elsa. I like that. So we've actually got, I think we've got two weddings on the cards. We've got a Homer and we've got, wait, is it just Homer? Who else did we check up on today? I can't even remember. Right. I'm going to try and change my outfit. I think someone, you know what? I'm going to save the dinner jacket, actually, because the dinner jacket will be good when someone gets married. That'd be really cool. Right, I'm going to give me the pea jacket, even though it's a little bit of a weird color that I chose. I'm going to I'm gonna change into it anyway. That looks all right. And apparently, I really, really like it, which is awesome. And then I'm going to give myself a nice meal, too. What should I give myself? What do I feel like eating today? What is salt in bocca? I don't know, but that looks nice. Let's, let's eat that right now. <laughs> I kind of liked it too. Oh, I liked it a lot. That's nice. And I leveled up. Jeez. I need a new gift. Uh, I think a baseball bat would be pretty cool. Only use it for the, the purposes it is meant for though, please. No crazy Negan stuff from The Walking Dead. That would be horrific. What are you thinking about? Can I get inside your brain? Dan? Yep. Oh, presents. Okay, are you thinking about presents or did you get a present? I'm not too sure. And then in your belly is what we just served you. I like how they eat the plates as well. They always eat the plates. Oh my goodness. There's so much going on right now. Everyone's coming home. Phil wants to... Oh, I don't even know what's going on. Right, let's do these introductions because we desperately need them. Oh yeah, Phil and Smiley and Homer and Misty. Those are the two weddings on the cards. Right, let's see what's going on. Taylor had to fight with Freddy and will make up. Oh, I didn't know that. I did not know that. Right, help them out, buddy. Just leave it to me. Okay, here we go. Phil, going in with the fix-it relationship. Oh my goodness, look at them. Whoa, whoa, calm down. He's throwing bread. Why are you throwing bread? That's so mean. Oh. Oh. Did it work? Did it work? I think it worked. Yeah, there we go. Phil, good job, buddy. Well done. Oh my goodness. Look at his little shimmy. <laughs> That was amazing. I oh, man. Good today. You certainly did, buddy. Well done. That's awesome of you. You know what? I'm going to give baseball bouts out to everyone today. I don't even know why. <laughs> and a reward as well. It's more stomach medicine. Stop giving me stomach medicine, guys, please. If I worried about people watching me, I'd never get anything done. I guess. I guess. Right. Let's go and see what other friendships need to be either. Oh. Oh, maybe the fight happens. I think that's what happened. Maybe the fight happened. Oh my goodness, look at Spider-Man and Elsa. That's hilarious. That's so funny. Right, I need to go back to... Oh, Phil's left now. Okay. I need to go to... Grab Smiley back. And I just want to check their status. See if they're feeling pretty good. Because I think Smiley in that outfit and Phil in the suit would look incredible for a wedding. <laughs> Thank you for saying Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you as well. How are you feeling? I wonder if Phil ever dreams of me. I would have thought so. Want to get married? That's what I'm talking about. Want to get married. That's amazing. Right. We could have two weddings on the card soon. Very, very soon. Sans. Oh my goodness. Sans, what are you doing? That's amazing. Picture time. There we go. That's perfect. Right. Let's see what your problem is. He looks amazing. What time of day do you like the best? Oh, um, I'm going to go for evening. Nothing's quite as romantic as a nice sunset. It's true. True. Who have you got in mind, Sans? Huh? Who have you got in mind, buddy? Apparently, absolutely no one. <laughs> so just to finish out this episode, there weren't really too many other problems. I'm going to do a little love machine test just to see who is in line for getting together. Right. Let's do a compatibility. Do you want the forecast or the test? You know what? Let's do a forecast on Phil egg tree and then also smiley smiles so things are looking oh uh study or work chats level oh their love is getting worse why why is that going to happen okay let's uh, get rid of that let's go for um homer and misty oh no oh no wait <laughs> that looks even better the skies will be overcast and tempers will run high okay that that's a little bit better right we need to change this to a uh, homer real quick whoa Whoa, whoa, whoa. That looks amazing. Clear skies are predicted to last a long time. I like that. I like that a lot. That's a whole week of sunshine. 
three, four clouds. That's it. That's awesome. Right. Okay. Let's do the compatibility test. Let's go for, um, let's go for Homer and Misty. Let's test these guys. Here we go. Here we go. Give me that big fat 100%. 70. Okay. Pair wear pair. If both make steps, they can head in the right direction, which they are right now. I love Homer's tie, by the way. Looking fantastic. Now we need to change that out for Phil Eggtree and Smiley Smile. Here we go. Let's test these two. What's it going to say? Come on. Come on. Let the dream live. 67, talk of the town. However, Smiley isn't all that into it anyway. Oh, no. But it says they're going to get married soon, so I'm hoping they will. Right. Let's set up some other people. Let's see if Marceline... And who can we set Marceline up with? You know what? Marceline would be perfect with Jack. But I haven't set his date of birth. So I need to do that because these two, look at them. They look perfect together. What about Marceline and Harry Potter though? This could be an interesting one. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, no. Okay, maybe not. You know what? Let's back out of that. What about Magikarp and Jigglypuff? That is a match made in heaven, surely. Come on. Come on. Don't let the dream die. Hey, look at that. It's a great match with Jigglypuff's passion may call. Lovey-dovey. That's the highest one so far. We've got two people marrying that have less of a connection than that. That's impressive. And look at Magikarp's hand. It's the same color as his face. That's such a cool little detail. <laughs> Prioris and Princess Peach. I think this could go well. I think this could go really well. What's it gonna say? 94! Perfect mix. This friendship will be treasured forever. That's a friendship rating. Okay, that's crazy good. I love that. Right, more love testing. Who else? Two-Face and Ghast. Two-Face and Ghast have got to be a good match. They must be. 30%. I'm not sure what they're doing right now. Even with luck, this will never work. Okay, that's fine. This is a love rating. Okay, so there's a difference between love rating and friendship rating. I like that. Grim and Tori will look pretty nice together as well. Look at that. They match in color. I like that. They're kind of like all monotone and gray. And oh, okay, maybe not. Neither person is interested. Fine, whatever. Okay, here's a potential weird one. Sans and Toriel. Is there a secret love there in the Undertale land? No. No, there, there isn't. <laughs> I really want to find a secret match. Ursula and Sans. Ursula and Sans, come on. Come on, please be funny. Please be funny. Come on. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh, I'm going to be sick. Ah, ah. Okay, maybe not. That's actually kind of cute. You know what? They kind of match in a very, very weird way. They kind of match. If just one of them puts in the effort, it might just work out. Okay, we've got a lot of stuff to test out. That is awesome. I love that. Right. Okay, I think that's gonna be- Oh, wait, we've got a news flash. Okay, I didn't expect this. I didn't expect this. What's the news flash? Two-Face girl. News, breaking news, here we go. Oh! The romance ranking has been added to the ranking board. Perfect! 100 pairs of potential lovers are calculated based on their compatibility tests and results. Yes! You are the most lovely daddy on the island. There's only one way to find out. This is perfect! The results are always changing, so get them regularly to see if romance is meaningful. I will, I will. Thanks for watching. No problem. Oh, that's awesome. That's so good. That's perfect for what we're doing today. So does that come in here in the rankings board? Let's have a look. It's here. Which couple is a match made in heaven? Ranking is based on compatibility tester. Oh, here we go. This is perfect. Look, Voldemort and Elsa are 99. What? Dan and Elsa are together. Oh, no, Voldemort and Elsa are 99%. That's so high. That's so high. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my... what? That's that's crazy. Okay, right. Let's see who else is in for some love. Magikarp and Jigglypuff. That's a cute match. I love that. Homer S and Misty. Good. They're on the track to get married. Phil and Smiley are 67. They're on track to get married as well. Sans and Ursula, my favorite ones so far. Um, Treoris and Gemma. They're together, actually. So, I did test uh, Treoris against someone. Garston, Two-Face, 30%. Grim and Toriel, 17. Sans, Dan, CDM, and Gemma. Look at that. Oh, no. We're terrible. Dan, TDM, and Jeremy have absolutely awful chemistry. What a shame. What an absolute shame. But you know what? That's actually kind of cool. I love that. <laughs> That's really cool. Oh, man. 99%. I am shocked. But I think we found that out in a previous video. I'm pretty sure. I dropped my stylus. Actually, while we're here, let's see who the highest boy is. Oh, it's Dan TDM, then Craig, then Brock. Actually, Craig hasn't got a special someone. Let's go Craig with... Oh, all of these top ones are taken. Oh, my goodness. Um, Taylor. Taylor, Craig and Taylor. Is Taylor taken as well? Oh, I can't remember all these relationships, guys. There's so many. But anyway, 
That's, this has gone on for way too long. This has been pretty awesome doing the love testing. That was really, really cool. So, um, you know what, guys? Thank you so much for watching this video. I'm sorry there was so much gap in between. Look at Princess Bubblegum spin. Yeah, I'm so sorry that it had so much time in between. I've just been incredibly busy and didn't have time to sit down and play it, but it will be back regularly. Don't you worry. And let me know if you want to see it more regularly by hitting that big fat thumbs up button. That would be greatly appreciated. Leave a like for all the love testing. <laughs> yeah, thank you again so much for watching. If this happens to be the first video you see by me, please do consider subscribing to join Team TDM today for daily gameplay videos. And apart from that, thank you guys so much for watching. You are the best. Have an amazing day and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!